My name is Marisol, this is my husband, Nick. We have our dining room that's a little bit mixed match. We don't really know what to do with it. So yeah, Patty, we need your help. Wow. wow. Are you kidding me? Even if you're renting, home is home. Oh I'm Patty Wagner, and I've got one day to do a total refresh on one room. Oh my God. <laughs> using easy, renter-friendly ideas. Open your eyes. Oh, wow. Ding me. Wow. <laughs> Good job. Hi, Patty. Hey, Patty. My name is Marisol. This is my husband, Nick. We just moved here from Miami. The room that I am having an issue with is our dining room. We have all these built-in shelves that I don't really know what to do with. We have a baby who's almost two. So please help us out, Patty. We could really use your help. I'm heading to meet Marisol and Nick. They live in a very cute craftsman. How adorable is their house? <laughs> Patty, what's up? Welcome. Yes, thanks for having me. Of course. What a charming place you moved from, Miami. Yep. This is a lot different <laughs> from where you different. moved from, right? Very, very different. different. Yeah. Gosh, I love all of the woodwork, even the detail and the ceilings. Let's just oh, go into your dining room welcome. here because yeah. this is where you need help. This yes. is where we need the most <laughs> yes. help. Help us. There's all these built-ins. I don't know how to style them. Maybe if we just had one or two, but we have so many. And I styled so... a couple myself. <laughs> yeah, oh, I, this is the yeah, new is... styling yeah. skills right here. <laughs> so that was our wedding day. We kind of just put it up there because there happened to be a nail there. <laughs> I do see some kids' toys kind of scattered throughout. <laughs> we can definitely help you organize it. The lighting fixture, do you like it? Uh, it's a little dated. Yeah, <laughs> it's not our favorite. But you know, it's what came with the house. And this is your furniture that you brought with you. Mm -hmm. Kind of has more of a coastal feel. Mix in with some of these more traditional details. Yeah. And they're kind of not quite working together. Exactly. <laughs> All the woodwork can make it feel really dark. Is your landlord cool with us painting the walls? He's okay with that. I have so many ideas running through okay. my head. I want to help you guys embrace all of this because mm -hmm. it's beautiful. Let's yes, do it. Yes. Let's do We're it. Excited. Yeah, let's just Whoa. get everything out of here. The helmets, I'm happy to see them go. My plan is to brighten up these walls with a lighter color that will complement the wood tones. I'll switch out their Miami Vibe furniture and dated light fixture for pieces that will bridge Marisol and Nick's modern style with the room's craftsman details. The woodwork, the built-ins, the trim, all of those things, that's what makes an old house charming. You just gotta embrace that. To style all these built-ins, I'm asking Marisol to help me find more treasures around the house. You've got some good stuff here. I love this yeah. because everything is that mid-tone wood. I want something just a little bit lighter. Let's go to the basement. I have a few things there. <gasps> Ooh, this is so pretty. These colors, these are great. I am going to let you two go. Okay. And I'm gonna get working. Okay. Yes, great. let's do it. When I first saw these walls, I knew immediately that they had to be lighter, and it was just a matter of which white I wanted to go with. I can already see how this color is going to brighten up the space. We're putting on the second coat of paint, and it's looking so good. It really is a nice contrast with the built-ins. Before you remove any light fixture that's a part of your rental, make sure that you get permission from your landlord. And you want to save the old light fixture just in case your landlord wants you to put it back when you move out. I found this great brass chandelier. The price was awesome. Amazing. Oh, I love it. The before was traditional, heavy. It was a little too big as well, but this one is like the perfect size. Love the brass finish. I love it. <laughs> I found this table at an antique shop and I couldn't even believe the price. It is the perfect table for here. Here comes the chairs. This set, it's not fighting with the built-ins. It complements it. 
They live in a house with original wood floors. Just apply some felt feet to make sure that you don't damage the floors because you don't want to lose your security deposit by scratching up the floors. Before, there was a cushion on this bench here that had this print and pattern, which wasn't quite Marisol and Nick's style. So I got it reupholstered for them. I gave their cushion a fresh new look. And the great thing is they can put back the old one if that's what the landlord prefers. Huge difference. Now the fun part, styling these walls and shelves. The trick is to always make sure that you only bring in what you love. I love to find items that are meaningful, but also there's like a color palette. Books are always a great styling item. I'm going to lean these ones because I already have these stacked, so it kind of just has a good visual flow. Kids' toys are always very colorful, so it's nice to just hide them away. This way, her little guy can still reach them, but it looks nice. I wanted to give them a little piece of Miami and the beach. I think I'm gonna finish off the styling with something for Nick. They're on their way. They're almost here and I am so excited to share this dining room with them. Are you guys oh ready? My oh god. my god. Oh, wow. wow. Are you it's kidding me? Beautiful. It doesn't hey. even look like the same house. Look at the picture. <laughs> My goal was to lighten and brighten up the space. The old one yeah. was very traditional. We kept it for you, so if your landlord wants to swap it back, you can swap it back before you move. I so found good. this in an antique store for you. Can you believe no it? No way. So for a cool. steal. This is, this is amazing. so amazing. amazing. If you look at the leg, just that simple, perfect mid-century modern yeah. to really tie back to what's going on here. And then these chairs. I really wanted something that was comfortable, but I love that it also breaks up all of the warm wood tones we've got going yeah, on here. I agree. Doesn't it look like it like went together? Yes, yeah. <laughs> yes, yes, it belongs here. Yeah. I centralize most of Theo's toys. Mm -hmm. So we've got oh, that's a good idea. baskets. Oh, yeah. Why didn't we think of that? <laughs> For your walls, remember you just put stuff up because there were nail holes. Yeah. <laughs> We printed out photos and printed them out in black and white to tie back to what you already have in your living room. Every room should have a personal touch. I feel like this is exactly what you would have wanted. Yeah. And it's just hard I to it. put it together. Oh, can you spot? Can you spot it, <laughs> I Nick? spot it. I see uh, it. Yeah. I see it. I'm still here. Yeah, you don't have to have them all out. You just need the one. You're right. Yeah. You're right. I agree. It works. Yeah. Thank you, Patty. Thank you so much. It's amazing. Oh. <laughs> Hey, Patty. We just wanted to give you a quick update. We love our new room. We love how bright it is. We love that we finally feel like we have a space of our own. We love coming home at the end of the day to a, a beautiful space that we can call our own. Thank, Thank you. you.